Hello everyone, Snowflake Frostflame here, and welcome back to the Escapist. <clears throat> now, it's been a while since I played. By a while, I mean like a few days, but before that it was like a week, because my the reason why is because my work had me work for six days straight, and I could never find time to record. Now, this prison has been giving me a lot of pain. It should be an easy prison, but there's a lot of rocks underneath the the, wall, the map. There's a lot of walls that you can't mine for no reason. And I can't tell the difference between walls you can and can't mine. And this prison's just been giving me a lot of hell. Like, at first I thought, like, you had to dig under in a certain area. I thought maybe you'd have to use, like, a grappling hook and a sheet rope to get on top of a building. I thought many different things. So, I found... found one guy, the only video I've ever seen of the Xbox One version of escaping this prison. And I'll put his name up on screen. I owe this guy all all the credit for me escaping tonight. I would have never figured that out. Like I, I might have eventually, but I was literally at the point of giving up on the series and just moving on to my next game until I found this guy's video. So, we're going to be moving on with the escape attempt. All we really need are these four items. And, so yeah. Don't even need that grappling hook or that sheet rope. So, yeah. I, I don't know. Maybe I'll, if I, I don't know if I should just cut tonight or if I should just play the night or the day. I think I'll just play the day. Why not? It gives me some footage to use. Actually, no, I'll cut ahead. Okay, I'm back. Now, I don't have any contrabands in my cell, so I can actually skip roll call. One thing I never knew, as soon as the guards start talking, that counts as you attending and you can leave. And uh, it won't go under lockdown. So, we need here. And I've had plenty of problems with this one door. There we go. As Every time I try going there, I always get electrocuted. Now, take off the inmate outfit, put on the guard uniform, and now we just have to wait until um, roll call ends. Because we'll get sniped. Okay, lights out. Now, what you do, one thing I never knew is you're supposed to use your pickaxe on the floor, not your shovel. And it goes down much quicker. Also, there's an interesting glitch I discovered on this map. You see the nurse? Boop. No more nurse. Anyways, come down here. And you want to keep digging forward. We're going to dig twice. And then we dig up. Or was it once? Ah, we'll do it twice. Okay, inventory is full. Drop some soil. Alright, now we'll dig up. Inventory is full. Let's drop my shovel real quick. Actually, let's drop an excess dirt. Fill up the hole. Grab my shovel again. Come up here. Fill up this hole. This door can only be opened if you have a guard's uniform. And this door can only be opened if you have a right key. Oh my god. And then you just come down here. And we did it. Oh my god. That... I guess there was supposed to be a cutscene that played there, but uh, I, I guess I never programmed it, so I, I think it defaulted to the Jungle Compound's uh, audio. Anyways, that took way too long. That was the most stressful prison I've ever done. I'm, I'd have rather done HMP Iron Gate I, for a second time than do this ever again. And it's only stressful because 
there's electric fences, rocks everywhere, none of the walls you can break down, it just leaves you very confused of what you're supposed to do. And not to mention, in the PC version, you escape a completely different way. In the PC version, there are no rocks or alongside the, uh, the underneath the electric fences, so you can dig under the fences, go out to the outer side, and then what you're supposed to do is go along to that guard side that you saw, and there's a sweet spot in the wall where you break open the thing, and you just use the red key, and get around and get to the boat. With me, I had to do it that way. My god. That means there are five more prisons left, but I think I might take a break from the Escapist and move on to a different series. Mainly because this is going on too long and the Escapist is starting to give me a headache and I don't want to get stuck on a prison again and just quit on the series. Cause I've nearly quit on this series four times just because of this one prison. But yeah. Uh, thank you everyone for watching. In the next episode, in the next video, we'll be playing something completely different. I'll eventually come back to the Escapist, I promise. Maybe after this next uh, series is done, because I don't think this next series is going to take as long as the Escapist is. But well, once I'm done we'll be, with that, we'll be coming back to the Escapist, so it's not completely forgotten. So yeah. Here's a little hint of what my next uh, video is going to be, or Let's Play. So yeah. Um, thank you everyone for watching, and I'll see you then. Goodbye.